Let's play a game. All of these animals lived with the dinosaurs. And then, so the game is, can you guess which animal survived? Match one. This was a mouse-sized mammal that ate seeds and nuts and insects, while this one was the size of a raccoon and hunted and scavenged. Take a moment and think about it. And while you do, subscribe. All right, the winner is the little guy. It could burrow and eat what it could find, while the larger guy was too big to survive off the little food left after the impact. Match two. These were fast-moving creatures, and they hatched at the surface of the water, while these were less active, and they hatched on the seafloor. The winner is this one, the Nautilus. It moved slower, and it had a slower metabolism, so it needed less food. There were fewer of them than the other one, but they lived in more places, meaning there were pockets of survivors in less impacted regions. One more, match three. Remember, acid rain is falling from the sky. This bird likely searched for its prey in the water, while this was the most common bird group at the time, and very diverse. Think about it, and while you do, these visuals are from the American Museum of Natural History's newest exhibit, so go check it out. And the winner is... Not that one. Scientists think that the waterfowl's habit and diet helped it survive. So how many did you get right? If you got all three, subscribe, winners only.